alive. Welcome to PBA Pro Bowling 2021 or 2021, whatever you want to call it. Um, I just downloaded this game. It literally finished like two minutes ago. Booted it up and started uh, making a live video on it. So today we are going to be doing the career mode on this game. Never played it. Th I played the first one. Uh, it got very repetitive really quickly. I have not seen any gameplay trailer. I did see that they posted one. I've not seen it yet. So this is my first impressions of PBA Pro Bowling 2021. So without further ado, I noticed the menu looks way different this time. Let's get started. I have 50,000 tickets and 200 gold pins. As you can appear, you can purchase. Oh, I got it. Uh, bowling balls. Okay, got it. it. Looks exactly the same as last game, menu wise. Uh, got all these. Where's the specific ball that the legendary Tick Nation, another. YouTuber who will most likely make a game. Yep, here it is. The first ball you gotta get, just like last year, the Black Wood Hammer Black Widow Red Legend. Okay, career mode. Choose the pro bowler you want to play as. Uh, what? Hold on, hold on. Can I? What? I've what? That's how they're doing. Stop! Don't you dare tell me this is how. What? So you're not bowling as yourself anymore? You have to bowl as a pro, in career. Hold on. I I clicked. Okay, career. Choose the pro bowler you want to play as. Um. What? What? Okay, sure, cool. Uh, you got all the other pros. Uh, we'll go PB3 because he's a left-hander like me. Uh, compete. The PBA shows me. Okay, whatever. It's the. You bowl as a pro in career mode. This isn't. No, oh my God. This just. Hello, bowling fans, and welcome to tonight's exciting event. Thrilled you're here with us today, Rob Stone and the Hall of Fame. Use the left stick. Yeah, I know how to play this. It's the same. Yeah, it's the same controls as last year. Hold up, I'm using a house ball. Okay. Eight pins, leaving the three and six. So, you bowl as a. This one is very makeable. You bowl as a, a PBA pro in career mode? Okay. This commentary is going to get annoying real quick. It's the same as last year, too. Uh, announce your volume. I'm going to turn that all the way down. So, in career mode this game, you bowl as a freaking pro. I got three people watching. Hey! That's how it's done. Messenger? Oh! Just missed it. So, I will admit right now, this game took a pretty big step back for step back as career mode. You can't bowl as yourself anymore. You have to bowl as a PBA pro in career. This... No! What? Why can't... I sure... I mean, it's better than the default character that you had last year. I mean, you have that, but bowling as a PBA pro is just weird now, like, add a custom character creator as yourself, 
so you can literally bullet yourself and move up the ranks. But you have to bowl as a pro to do really. I, I don't. I don't get it already. Uh, yeah, yeah, I get how to play this game. I unlocked the pinball. Cool. But it's. I want to see the new stepladder thing. They said that they added a lane breakdown. I don't see it because I'm literally throwing the same shot every time, and I'm gonna. Do that a little bit slower. Oh, he still gets a strike. That's how it's done. Curve. Oh, yeah. Ten down. Let's go. It's, it's the easiest thing to do is this, but it's bugging me that you have to bowl as a pro and not the default custom character that was created for you. Like, this just makes the game not fun anymore already. By the way, this game is $25 to get this game. Where is the lane breakdown? They said there was lane breakdown. Where is it? My first game, I bowled a 270. Oh, who could have seen that coming? A 270. It's the same game. League. League night. Okay. <sighs> I want to see this new stepladder feature that they're going on about this game. But already this game has been pretty disappointing. I turned off the commentary and the music already because, yeah, they will get really annoyed. That's why. Hmm, that should have. Uh, okay, then. You know, I feel like that could have made it, but okay. And let's go. I have not seen any lane breakdown over. Is that over a period of games? Because that's kind of. I mean, it makes sense. But, like, why not in the same game? Because I feel like I'm playing the same line. And can throw the same shot every time. There's another one. Turkey. Curve. Let's go. Pin physics were also improved. Uh, should have. Uh, I mean, it get wide, but sure. Should choose a. Let's figure. I'll do that at the throw shop. Right after this game. The only thing I noticed difference is that you feel like you have to slow down the shot a little more. Um, I mean, it, it's alright. I'm still, like, gonna obsess about the pro thing. It's really annoying. Like, how is that, what? How is that even, like, remotely fun in any way that you've got a bowl as a PBA pro?
curve. Can your created bowler be a two-handed bowler? It's, I, you know, I wish it was created bowlers this year as well, but it, you bowl as a PBA pro. So you theoretically could, yes, bowl as a PBA pro. Uh, I'm bowling as Parker Bone a third, and this is career mode, which is really interesting. So probably, yes, you could bowl as... Yeah, oh, okay. First place. This is the same game as last year, and yet they charge us. Yeah, it's the... It's the exact same. And you could change your bowler? Are you sure you want to start a new career or part? Oh! So if you want to bowl differently... Looks like they copy your page. It's basically what it is. And if you want to change your bowler, you got to start a new career? That's a yikes for me. I mean, it makes sense. You're starting over, but... Once you pick that bowler, you're stuck with him for the whole career mode. Unless you want to just get rid of all your progress and... Just start over. Um, I haven't... S I'm questioning their logic for this game. $25 for the same game... You bowl as a pro in career, which doesn't make sense. It, I'm just questioning what their logic is behind it, all this. Dang, six people is the most people I've had in a live stream before. WTF Farsight L. <laughs> oh man. Famous words made by the legendary Tick Nation. Tick Nation is the man, by the way. Okay, I could see some oil breakdown now. So is it in a three game period? Because I didn't get any of the first game and I just left this. Wait. Also, I should get a spare ball, which I'm gonna do now. Uh, yeah, sure. Come on. Nope, not that one. Okay, cool. And... Oh yeah, that's how it's done. But it, this game, like Penguin Bob said, it's a copy-paste of last year's game with, like, minor changes. Like, this could have been an update for free, but they had to charge it. Every company nowadays it seems to be taking the EA route of charging you for the same game every year. Oh, that's right. I saw that. Oh! I got a lucky break there. Six pin. There's gonna be a battle pass <laughs> next month. Huh? Oh man, I could totally see Farsight doing that too, which is so annoying. I just want a good game. Like, you know, what they had last year was fine, but the step ladder thing could have been in an update. Bowling as the PBA Pro could have been in an update. Because last year's game was fine for all that. But, you know, it's like, you know what, we, let's charge them 25 bucks for the same game last year. It's fine. It's like everyone else does it anyway, so why can't we? You know, because we just want a good game. That pen went crazy, oh my god. And another one. Alright. I have a bold less than 200 all day, sir. So. In this 15 minutes of streaming, I should say. Oh, trips out the six. Dang, nine people watching, oh my god. Alright, first, uh, the only thing I noticed, the menu looks different. 
uh, which is this. Why did it bring me back to the main menu? I've never... Okay, sure. Ten people... Oh my... Freaking out. They made a whole new game for one new PBA Pro that nobody knows about? Well, well, well. Right? Like, where's Pete Weber? Everyone was asking for Pete Weber in the last game. He's still not in this game! Like, what is going on? Durf. Oh, that was nice. Is the oil breakdown in a three game period? Oh, let me, uh. I. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do you see that line? Like right here where my arrow is. On the little bit to the right of it. Parker Bone. I couldn't see. Licensing agreements probably. Yeah, I could see that. But this line right here. That's interesting. I just bowled over it. Ooh. Okay. So they made it look. They could have added early. Pete with Mark Roth, etc. I like Penguin Bob said it would be licensing. Hey, Pete Weber's probably like, give me some money, and they're, and they're like, uh, no. Then no, then. You know. So I can see something like that happening. Pay 25 bucks to see a line on the floor. <gasps> right? Where's the free update? Yeah, I paid 25 bucks to see a line on the floor. Oh my god. What a deal, guys. 10 out of 10. I recommend this. No, I'm just kidding. Truthfully... I will give this game a, uh, I'll give it a 5 out of 10. And that's being nice. Oh, that was, where did that, oh, morning, where did that pin come from? And they're reusing the same models as last year too, like, update the character models too. Because there are some that look really bad last year. So I can imagine them looking really bad this year, such as EJ Tackett. Oh, his model was horrendous last year. Like, he was even proportioned right on his body. Damn, new physics are showing strong. Oh, right. Oh, that's wide. Never mind. How did that even strike? That should have been like a, you know, a light bucket or something. Can you finally create a your bowl? No. In career mode, you have to bowl as a PBA pro, which is really annoying, and I don't like that. Hit him thin, watch him spin. Yes, sir. And... Oh, yeah! <laughs> Apologize for the headphone users. That was really loud. I won't lie. I won't lie, but looking at that line is going to really bug me, so it turned off. Huh. Okay. You know, I'm playing over the same part. I expect some through the, like, shots to go through the nose. That's a little bit of a right at target, I can tell. Are you bowling as Marshall Kent? I am bowling as Parker Bone the Third. Because you have to parent... Which is really weird why they took out your... Pin physics are A+. Plus. You know, pin physics, I won't lie, are pretty good. Sometimes. Depending on what you get. Joey Whalen. So, I can see that. I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, I want to see the new um, stepladder thing that they added. Because... That was probably my selling point for this game, for me, was the, um, let me check some real quick. Wait, are these the same damn tournaments as last year's game? Yes, they are. I also, I believe, yep, the line's still there. Huh, interesting. Okay, cool. So it does carry over from game, from the three games, but I wonder if the physics will still play the same. So we'll give it a try. 
Still playing like, you know, I mean, I did go like a messenger pin a little bit. Yeah, this game's the, it's a copy-paste of last year, directly, with a few minor adjustments. This could have been a free update, because it's the same tournaments as last year, everything's exactly the same. How do you leave a 4-pin? What? Okay, you know, yeah. sure. Just, you know, leave a 4-pin, why don't you? Okay, that's pretty good physics. I can see leaving that as a righty, but not as a lefty, right? So, physics improvement? Eh, I don't know. This game is just a complete nightmare, in my opinion. Might have to lower my rating from a five. Okay, that was interesting. Let's see that kind of thing. That's BBJ physics. Right Better pin physics, pocket four pin, right? Hi, come on now. I'm a, I'm bowling as a, I'm bowling as PB three. A left. Oh, I saw that nine pin for a second. That was interesting. Do they show replays? Okay, they do, but right after their animation. That was, uh... That was pretty... Interesting. Yeah, you can literally just play the... Almost the exact same line as... Every shot. And get a strike. I wonder if it's gonna ha... It's... This game's gonna get repetitive real quick. Oh, let's go. There's another one. Okay. I can... Are there commentators in this game? There are. I just have them off because nothing is the same. Everything's the exact same as last year. Like, they have the same commentary lines everything. At the very beginning, you can hear them a little bit, but then I was like, okay, it's going to be repetitive, so I turned them off. I saw the 710, and I wanted to go for the 710, I won't lie. One thing I am noticing is pins... I remember when you added spin after you threw the ball. Yeah, that was uh, that's still there, it's just on arcade mode. Uh, but I'm not about that arcade stuff. Then they added an update and made it way easy, too easy to strike. Right? As soon as I... I like as soon as you say that, I leave uh, the 2-4-3. Oh, I'll advance the next turn. Cool. Okay, top four advance. So, I wonder because I finished first, I should be number one seed. Right? They said for over events. Unless they just left the same thing for a league night. Let's see. Okay, so this one's the same. This isn't the step ladder. Is that on the PBA tour that they added the step ladder? Um, okay, because this one's the exact same as last year, where it's the bracket style format. So let's go against Randy Abbey again. All right. Opening shot for Parker Bone the third, who's apparently decided to start from the beginning, and he leaves a split. Okay then. I wonder how easy it is to bounce out pins. Um, I'm give this a try. Uh, straight at it, 23 points. And it's still like nearly impossible. Those are. That wasn't the step ladder format, right? There's a girl that's three seed. You saw that, right? I did not see that. Um, I gotta watch. I gotta look back in. How do you leave that? How do you leave the seven, eight, ten? Okay, sure. And he'll. How come he can bounce out pins really easy? What? That was thrown like point four miles an hour slower than. Or faster than mine. Oh, that's a gutter ball. I 
I'm gonna have to go back and look at that Joey Whalen and uh, see what you mean. Oh my god, he just bowled a double gutter. <laughs> this is gonna be the easiest game ever. Oh, that's wide. Oh my, how do you, okay. No thumb bowler? Interesting, right? Double G. What the? Right? I've never seen anyone bowl like that. I'm gonna laugh if he gets a third gutter in the row. Oh, he kept it on the lane, but he goes crossover. Goes Brooklyn. I guess he goes crossover. I don't know. Anyways. Alright, he gets the strike. Fourth frame. Crosses over again. As soon as they cross over strike, it seems to be a lot more easier to get than last year. I don't know if that's just me though. Oh, that's why. What is that? How do you leave the nine pin out of all that? How does the n improved pin physics? Yeah, somehow leave a nine pin when you go Brooklyn. Okay, are you bowling against the league bowler? Yeah. That was, uh, not surprising that it was pretty easy. Max 255 and max 248. And... Hey! Yeah, I'm bowling against the league bowler as Parker Bone the third. Yeah, this is a fair matchup right here. Oh, Alright, 2410. And I'm gonna guess he'll get one. Oh, he made that! What? I won't lie, that was pretty cool to see, but dang, he made that. Greek Church, yeah, you're not making that. If he makes the Greek Church, I'm so done with this game. If this character makes the Greek Church. I was freaked out when I saw that pin go flying to the left. Another strike. Who could have predicted that? Did you see Tick's video saying he couldn't find this game? I saw he posted that on Twitter. Um, I did reply to his uh, Twitter reply though and told him that it, where it was. It was. He just had to scroll down a bit more to find it. I'm gonna. I'm expecting Tick Nation's video to come out. Uh, probably in like a bit for his live stream. So, like, if he goes live, I may just stop and just watch his stream. Because, you know, Tick Nation's pretty funny when he rants about Farsight. Oh, I thought that was a gutter. You on PS4? I am on PS4. Seems like uh, surprisingly a lot of people, or quite a, more people than knew will watch this. So, expect an episode 2 to come out. Yep, so there you go. Alright, and strike. Alright, predicted that, obviously. So YouTube allows people to stream at 1k subs. How are you allowed to stream at 11? I'm on PS4, that's why. Uh, from your cell phone, you have to be able to stream at 1,000. From your computer, you can stream at whatever subs. I know. YouTube is, like, really weird, like, all with the live streaming stuff. Oh, that was, uh... Okay. But this, yeah, honestly my big thing about this game, like I said, I've said this already like 20 times. You can't bowl as yourself. You have to bowl as a pro in the career mode. So it's not a career mode, it's a bowl as a pro while you go through events. You know, it's the same as last year. 
and they call and they're just calling it career. I want to see a creative character you create yourself, you know, and like you know, like it would be interesting. Like I know it's I know it's just bowling, but it'd be cool to see like a bowling game with like a storyline to it and everything. That'd be uh pretty cool. Like a little bit of a story to it. And make it like where you sign with uh, companies. I gotta look it back on the video like what Joey Whalen said with. Why does it keep bringing me back to the menu? But. Let me find, I wonder if I, they're in the. I would click that, but yeah, I'll we'll just do that. Can I go back and look at round one? I cannot look back at round one. Still. Should I get this game? I bought the launch version for PS4. Be able to. Christian, I would say, um, mm, that's a, that's a tough choice. Should you get this game? Oh, that's, uh, that's honestly really tough. Mm. Um, mm. you know, part of me wants to say no, but also part of me wants to say yes at the same time, but, uh, I don't, it's like, I don't want anyone to, like, it's like, uh, I'll be just, I'll just say, uh, it's, mm, I don't, and Nintendo Switch back in October, yeah, I got the Switch version as well, um, honestly, I don't know if you should get it or not, because they added, like, it's basically the same game as, it's the same game as last year, with some minor changes and that's it so they added step ladder final which is like, for me the big change that they made to this game they say they updated some physics but it's still a little bit all weird and stuff and how is this guy literally striking at the same time oh. so honestly it's a just a, i don't know if you should get this game like i want to say yes but i also want to say no kind of thing Okay, I can understand leaving a four pin as a righty. I left a four pin as a. I'm bowling as because you have to bowl as a pro now in career, which is, you know, just interesting. Sweet. Oh, I'll say that's pretty, honestly, the most realistic thing I've seen because I played the same line. So maybe because I didn't wait. Did you get this game already? Because, you know, it feels exactly the same. Oh, my God. How did... Oh, that was so close. <laughs> that was so close at Parker. But I was just like, hmm, I'm just thinking. I wish you could skip the bowler because, you know, what? he's wasting time and he just throws a gutter ball. Are we gonna see another double gutter? Not this time. Leaves an open frame. What a surprise. Ten pin. You got it. If these were actually boars, they wouldn't be able to make a single spare. Back in October. Yeah, honestly, the game back in October, if you got it back then, it's fine. But this version, because this is the obviously the new updated version for the... It's 25 bucks. Um, honestly, I don't know whether you should get this one or not. Because I think everyone could literally just stick to this, this first game and be totally... Yeah, what well, Penguin Bob skit? Penguin Bob said, "Like, don't, like, if you don't have last year's game, then I would say get this one. But if you have last year's game, I would honestly just say don't get it. It just depends on the situation, because it's the same 
stuff as it's it's a copy paste as last year. Literally minor changes, but you're not missing much in this game. Um, was it worth twenty-five dollars? No, five dollars, yes, or a free update, yes. But twenty-five dollars seems a is pretty excessive for a copy-paste game. I just got it so I can, you know, honestly review it. Um, I knew what I was expecting walking in. My expectations weren't very high. Um. Oh, that was some. That was close to a gutter ball. They added another thing that they also added was on like a proper online multiplayer game, or at least they say they did. It was about ten to fifteen, I think about it. Yeah, ten to fifteen, I think about it. Twenty-five is pretty high. No, oh, that's. Oh, yikes. Hmm, that's a yikes for me. Okay, four count. All right, let's give this a try. And oh, I tried. I knew I also should have thrown a hook ball at it. But yeah, wide again. Oh, I actually got it to come back. Yeah, I haven't tried out the online head-to-head. -head. Oh, off spot. And it just, I was worried when this had half of when I had half the GB last year's. Right. This game was all another thing. Like what Drum Machine said, this game was 2.86 gigabytes of download space. Last year's game, I just looked at it before, was like 4.34 gigabytes. Storage space, that's with the updates too. I want to say that, but that still seems very like this seems very low for a game. I really do hope Farsight does watch this video, they'll probably more likely watch Tick Nation's video though on it. But uh, I really hope they at least watch this and take some of the criticism that all we uh have. Sweet, I unlocked the next circuit. Cool, what a surprise. That was really easy. Yeah, but... I want to see the... Yeah, it says local multiplayer, which is that. Online multiplayer, which is... You could... Hmm. Find match, and you could... You pick your pro bowler. So, you got... Let's go through the pros. Andrew Anderson, Chris Barnes, Don Barrett, Jace Belmonte, Parker Bone, Jacob Utrecht, Norm Duke, Liz Johnson, Tommy Jones, Shota Kazoe... Marshall Kent, Francois Lavoie, Wes Mollat, Bill O'Neill, Rano Page, Oscu Palermo, Sean Rash, Ronnie Russell, Matt Sanders, Anthony Simonson, Tom Smaller, Jesper Svensson, EJ Tackett, Kyle Troop, Stuart Williams, and Walter Raywin. Same pros as last year. Like, nothing different. That, and that's, this is online multiplayer, so you pick your pro, and then you just could do a private match on this, or whatever. Online tournaments. Uh, yes, yeah, the same as last year. The, the online tournaments are the same as last year. And then local multiplayer, you're just that's just with your friends and stuff. Like quick, quick plays, yeah. Just yeah, you can all pro shop and yeah, everything's basically the same. Yeah, all the pros are still 200 oil patterns. I wonder if they Salvino Weber. Yeah, all the oil patterns are still the same. Everything. What about venues? Did they add any? PBA still on. Bullmore, that seems to be, that's a new one is Bullmore, because, you know, Bolero, Corp, Bones, Bowling, the PBA now, whatever. But Bullmore seems to be the new one, uh, and if you want to change your, like I said, for those people that didn't hear, if you want to change your bowler in career, highly advise, uh, you'll have to start over. Not fun. But I'm not going to do it. Let's go to the Pro-Am. Uh, it's just like, uh -huh. Oh yeah, I just looked at the thing. Holy crap! Dang. There was a female, like uh, what uh, 
forgot what he said. Right. What was his name? I already forgot his name. So I'm so sorry if I forgot what your name was. I'm just not used to well, having so many new people on this channel. Alright, uh... I bet everyone, everybody's gonna be Belmonte. You know, I could probably see that, but... Obviously... Another thing, another thing with the microtransactions, too. Like, the gold pins and stuff. Sure, you can earn them, but... You have to unlock all the pros, like... That's what I, another thing that was the same. Okay, then, that was an interesting joke. Anyways, you have to unlock all that. Why don't you just give us everything already unlocked? Like, you gotta make us grind. This is the, essentially, like, you're playing, like, some version of, like, you know, like, my team or ultimate team in, like, Madden or NBA 2K. You can either grind it out and spend hours and hours of hours bowling against the people so you can get gold pins to unlock it or you can give us you know a hundred bucks and you could probably just unlock the whole game for a hundred bucks so another thing is last year is you realize you gotta spend hours and hours grinding out you know for the on this game I would I have to say that was pretty the, the most realistic shot I've probably thrown all day, besides the, some strikes. Bouncing out seems to be nearly impossible at 23 miles an hour. Right, who the hell is reaching level 900? Exactly! Who's gonna spend hours? Because I guarantee you'll get to the end of the game way before level 900. I can't wait to see Tick Nation cussing at, at Farsight. Right? That's gonna be amazing to watch. There's one. What, what the flip, Farsight? Come on! That's gonna be the most entertaining thing I've ever watched. Oh, that's a... Yeah. Best thing Bob said, who's gonna reach level 900? You literally will have, like, it's, you probably, I didn't even beat the last year's game. Oh, let me tell you exactly. Watching Tick Nation cuss out Farsight is pretty funny. You know, it's like, cause, you know, they, they, it's a well-deserved. Like, we just want a good game. Just a good game. But this is... All the controls are the same, so don't expect anything new with like, on any like weird buttons or anything. And... Totally forgot power ups were a thing. Why is that even in a game? You know, if you want to replicate PBA, I played every tournament and got mostly first in the last year, and I didn't even get to 100. Exactly! So, who's gonna spend way more time going to level 900 to unlock everything? You're just grinding it out. Leveling up in this game is ridiculously easy. And that's my first game that I bowled less than 200. Oh my god. What a surprise. Yeah, I'm, I just started 43 minutes ago. I'm already level 9. Let's see. I gotta look at something real quick. If you want to lock all the venues... Four thousand five hundred gold pins. I believe I might have miscounted, but I believe that's eight thousand five hundred right there, and then nine thousand. 9,200. Oops. So I'm going to quickly actually look at the, uh, the store real quick, the PlayStation store. This content can't be select. And their store doesn't even work. Are you kidding me? But it's like, I want to say, like, to probably unlock the whole game, you have to spend well up to, like, 
50 bucks. I feel as if the online multiplayer is not anything special. Is nothing special. You know, I probably will agree with that. But I haven't tried it yet, so... But it's, you know, it's probably just bowling online with people on really bad servers, is my guess. I don't... I want to check it out. Um... Yeah. Like, I really do want to check it out, kind of, maybe after a bit. Ooh, that was a lucky break. There's, but there's, it's the same thing as, like I said, many times, many, many times. Like, where is the fun in this? I, I've been playing for 46 minutes already, straight, and I already feel re like this is, I feel like I'm playing last year's game. I really do, like... I'm not getting my $25 worth of money out of this. Because, come on, you know, we don't need to spend... I'm starting to see the lane breakdown a little bit. I'm not getting my money's worth as well. I just bounce back and forth with so many topics. Oh my goodness. I wonder if I move left a little bit, if I can probably play something similar. Okay. So I think after this tournament that I finish for the three games or whatever, I'm going to check out online multiplayer because it seems like bowling games don't last long popularity wise. You know, I, I could feel that. Like, you see something that's like so, like. You know, because it's bowling games. Bowling games are the most simple, probably, games to, like, play. Like, uh, I feel like the, yeah, bowling's a dying sport. Yeah, that's definitely true. Um, a lot of, how did I not make that? The pin moved. I want to see the replay on this. Because I, I saw it move. So I must have, I, okay, that should have. It moved. It definitely should have, you know, probably knocked it over, but, you know, okay. I feel like the main game that everyone used to play, uh, the bowling game, was Wii Sports Bowling. That game was what probably, like, made the height of bowling was that game, and that was really cool, it's, and that was nice. You know, he's hyped up. Why can't I be as hyped up as him? Yo, I'm literally just sitting in my chair, just... My legs up on my bed, and relaxing. Wii Sports Bowling is better than... Wii Sports Bowling was really fun. Even the little mini-games that Wii Sports Bowling had back then was really fun. Like, all the little mini-games they had, too, were really fun. Like, we got, like, the spare challenge. Like, we need to have something like that. People still play it to this day. Exactly. I wish I had a... Didn't I... I swear, okay. Shouldn't have gotten my hopes up. What the hell... What the hell, Farsight? Exactly. Exactly. The 100 pin game. Yeah, the 100 pin game was also really fun. I love that game. You know, this is times where I wish I still had a Wii. So I could just go back and play, like, those mini games. Because I'll be... Whoa! Did you guys just see that? What the heck? just happened where is the the hidden strike in the hut exactly is it just me but is the left lane also uh seem to have this little did i like kill the lane just think because it crossed over a lot 
Yeah, the hidden strike in a hundred pin game was so much. I showed one of my friends that because he has a Wii, and he's like, "I gotta show you this trick." And I was like, "All right." He's like, "Well, all right, what is it?" And I showed him, and he's like, "How do you do that?" I'm like, "It probably." I was like, "Oh," and I just found it one day randomly. I was like, "I like I randomly found it." I was like, "I wonder what happens if I like for fun." I remember just throwing it. There. I was like, "I wonder what happens if I throw it all the way on one of the things." And I heard the beep, and it got a straight. I'm like, "Oh, that's cool." It's like a so I show one of my friends that, and he's like. He's like, dang, this is awesome. Wii Bowling is a really fun game to play. You know, if we, because Wii Bowling was probably what, like, I bet when we talk about bowling games, everyone talks about Wii Sports Bowling as that game that everyone played. I am starting to see the oil breakdown. Because if you would this line is. So I could see why you have to make some adjustments. But when you would talk about bowling games, everyone talks about Wii Sports bowling at one point. Because there's you know there's no denying that that was that's a classic. I just want to see a game. With like, you know, good physics. My, f besides we bowling, the second bowling game I had was the really awful Brunswick Pro Bowling. I found that, just funny story about the game. I've been wanting, I wanted a bowling game for a while and I didn't know there was that game out. And I randomly walked into the store one day and it's like, I totally forgot. I was like, there's a bowling game out on PlayStation. And it was Brunswick Pro Bowling. And it was at GameStop for 50 cents on the PlayStation 4, so I picked it up for 50 cents, and I was like, worth it! And then I looked back, I'm like, I'm glad I spent 50 cents. Curve. Okay, broke up the nine. So I do see the oil breakdown starting to kick in with that huge line. That part of the line is dead. So good for them for adding oil breakdown to this game. I used to play AMF, AMF bowling. Is nice. AMF bowling I never actually played before. How do you leave a pockets six? It was a little daylight, but yeah. Anyways. AMF bowling I've never actually played before. Baby split. Okay, so that's game two underway. Back down to second, behind Marshall Kent, or Marchoke Kent, because Marshall Kent apparently chokes in this game just like he does in real life. So it's kind of a interesting topic. I had a bowling game on my N64. I've... Do you remember what game it was? Because honestly that sounds like a lot of fun playing a game on the N64. I never played a game on the N64 though. <laughs> PBA Bowling just... PBA Pro Bowling's Twitter on um... Obviously Twitter. It just posted two minutes ago. It's now available on the PS4. And then it will come out on the Switch. Uh... Tomorrow, hold on. It comes out this game on the Switch tomorrow at noon. Xbox One on the 23rd. And it comes out at Steam this evening at 7 p.m. Pacific time. What the heck? So, them saying it comes out on the 21st is a huge lie to everyone on Xbox, Switch, and, I mean, Steam is, but Xbox and Switch. So that was a lie for them. They said it would come out on the 21st. So if I had a Switch, I would be very obviously disappointed. Yep. 
It's now available on PS4, Switch comes out tomorrow at noon, Xbox One comes out on the 23rd, and Steam tonight at 7 p.m. Pacific Time. So that's just in two minutes ago from nature. Oh, what a shot. Oh, I, the only thing I'm, the only reason why I'm really playing this game for this long too, because I never make live streams this long, they're usually like 30 minutes long. As I want to see the step ladder format in this game. That's my only thing I want to see is the step ladder. They're doing the exact opposite of what they did last year. PS4 last to be updated. Oh, I remember that. When the updates used to come out at different time or different days for consoles like oh this day is when it comes out on this console like just update the game at the same time as the other consoles sure it may take a while but you know just do it yeah so Xbox one for people that have an Xbox one uh, this game comes out on the 23rd, two days from now. So they're advertising for the tw 21st. It's a complete lie. You know, they're, and it's funny, is every like, little thing that they're doing is getting worse for Farsight. Why would PBA make a game with Farsight Studios? I mean, sure, that was probably like, you know, like they make other games, like the pinball games. Oh, I missed it. Holy crap. And those pinball games are... Eh, they're pretty fun for a bit. Oh, that's right. A target. Everyone raise their hand. Raise your hand, everybody. Just in case. Just kidding. I'm so sorry. Nobody gets any drinks from me. Sponsors on the bar are even the same order as last year's, right? They could have, like, you know, had a new sponsor. It's a cop. This game, every minute, is getting really annoying. Yep. Curve. Oh, 3-7. I bowl in real life too and I had a league last night and I was telling everybody, I was like, oh yeah, this game comes out today, so I'm gonna get it and yeah. <sighs> I'm pretty disappointed that nothing really, oh, I advanced to next time, I finished second, woo. I wonder because it's the pros, it, it happens and my TV decides to freak out on me and go AFK on me apparently. Yes, I'm still playing video games TV. Okay. Jojo, have you noticed if the oil breaks down carryover between games and qualifying? It does. That's one good thing that I noticed about this game, Jojo. Uh, Penguin Bob, I bowl in the league also. <laughs> Bowling in the league is really fun. How did I get a gold star? Oh, I was about to say, how did I get a... What the... Flip Farsight, you're a liar. I want this game to fail. <laughs> right, alright, let's see if this game has... I know it's the Pro-Am, so I expect it on the Pro Tour, but this is the Pro-Am. I was gonna shut down from COVID off. That sucks, yeah. My bowling alley got shut down. There's two bowling alleys I go to, one that's like 20 minutes, another 30 minutes away. Uh, the one that's 30 minutes away got shut down like for the third time already. Like they opened, or they closed back in March, they reopened in July, closed again. Reopened in September, closed again. Reopened in November, closed again. Where's the step ladder? Where is the step ladder? Like you said. I'm still. 
Yeah, this whole year has been a crazy year. Never seen anything like this. I'm still waiting for mine to reopen. Yeah. I'm surprised mine decided to stay open. I'm bowling against Kyle Troop. No stepladder, right? Like, where is it? You advertise the stepladder, and I haven't gotten a single stepladder. Unless they just added it to... I want to know if the... Probably the last tournament you're going to play. Probably for, I really just want to see the stepladder. That's really it. But I'm already kind of bored. Alright, Carol Troop. Let's see what you do. What ball was he using? Is that... Oh! He... <laughs> Same outfit, too. Exactly! Like, they don't even change the outfit. That's another good thing, Penguin Paul. They didn't even change the outfits from last year. Like, give them new uniforms. Four pin. There's a couple things I want to check out, which is the online multiplayer. Um, let me see if I could just find a match with someone. They could have at least put a comb in his back pocket. Exactly. Exactly. Yep. I still want to know a... Is that the... Oh, that's the Axiom. That's the Storm Axiom. I just kept trying to figure out... I was going to say, is that... I was about to say, did the game developers really get lazy and give him, like, a spare ball to Storm Ice? But, you know, it's the Axiom I saw the logo. And he just left a split, so... Have fun making this. You know what I think what you do is because they have you pick a pro to bowl as. Um, have you only used the ball come? What a shot! Your PS4 sounds like a jet engine like mine. I'm not the only one. It does that. You know, I read somewhere that it's because of how old it is. Mine's like one of the first. It's like I got it like when it first came out, so it's really old. With far side this laugh way back. <laughs> This is laughably bad. Clean it out. I need to clean it out. You know, I just... I'm honestly lazy. Uh, aww. But yeah, every old PS4 sounds like a jet engine. I wonder how this game runs on PS5. Your Marshall... Your Marshall can't... You boys... Hold on. I'm Parker Bone third, not Marshall Kent. Oh, solid nine. Oh, that was a. Uh... So I'm wondering, cause, yep, PB three. And I still wish you could see, like, their form or anything. Uh, your hair looks just like Kent. You know, I could kind of see that from the back a little bit. But I seriously can't believe this is the same game. Honestly, I agree. I really agree. Oh. Okay. No, I'm not even paying attention to the game anymore. It's... <sighs> Curve. Oh yeah. They failed once again. Mm -hmm. I 100% agree. Well, I might have just saved some of you guys 25 bucks unless you still want to get this game, but... Honestly, it's the same thing. It's the exact same. I just want to... If you can't even bowl stepladder like they said, 
Give you credit for being able to play this for an hour. Right? Ugh. I'm surprised I'm still playing it. I'm trying to give you guys something. You know, like... An on like, I'm, I'm, like, being completely honest here. I want to get... That's wide. Give you an honest review. I'm never on my PlayStation. And you definitely saved me 25 bucks. I wanted it for the step ladder and oil pattern, but I've seen neither. Right? I'm glad I did able able to save you 25 bucks. Uh, good thing. I'm glad I got paid, so I still got some money left over. So. Oh, look out! Baby split. Physics seems exact same. There's nothing is even different, and I missed it. But Penguin, I'm glad I saved you 25 bucks. Uh, yeah, honestly, for those people that didn't have last year's game and want a bowling game, get this one. But if you already have last year's, yeah, just save your money and you shouldn't have gotten excited. Mm -hmm. I got some. I got somewhat excited as you, Chris. I probably didn't get as excited as you, but I got excited a bit. Needs a strike and seven pins to shut me out. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, it's like, I haven't seen Tix live. Oh, he is? Is he really? Um, where's my phone? I just had it, too. Oh, my God. Oh, there it is. I might have to check out this, uh... Uh, let's see. Yep, he is. He is live. Alright, so, uh, after this game, I'm definitely ending the stream because I do want to see his live stream, so if you guys want to, uh, see his, uh, live stream, I go ahead and go over there uh, right now. I will let you guys go over there. Um, I will definitely see you guys over there. Um, I did lose to Kyle Troop, so. Yeah. So, yeah, this is where it's going to be ending off here. I would definitely see you guys over there at uh, Tick Nation's live stream. And uh, I move on. So, hopefully, a lot of you guys come back for episode two, and I'll see you guys later.